Greetings, I am Harry Larry from Gary, and this is episode 1134 of The Sims 4 Gallery Lots. And this particular lot is called The Hill of Fairies. It is on a 30 by 30 lot type residential. A little bit of a description here, more than welcome to read. While you're doing that, I'm going to go through these photos, see if it does a lot justice. First, you kind of do. Yeah, I'm got a feeling these photos are going to be hard to see any detail. But it makes it look cool. Yeah, definitely can't really tell anything. But, nice shape of the building, anyways. But, never fear, let's go take a look at the real thing. And yes, I did come in during the nighttime for this one. I was going to do daytime, but yeah, daytime got away from me. Yeah, that looks cool. All right, let's go down, take a look around. I got a feeling this lot's going to take a while to do. Side to side look. And since this section is pretty much all by itself, we'll just come on over here and take a look. Ooh, looks like we got some water sprites in here. Do we? Oh, yeah. That's cool. Definitely like the look of this little area. Oh, I didn't even notice the little baby uh, flamingo. Anything over here? a little barbecue. That will come in handy. Since there's only two spots to cook here, the barbecue area is one of them. Oh, I did not see the little trophy. There's a gate over here somewhere. Guess not. Alright, let's go take a look at this uh, area. Guess you do come from all the way from this side. I did not try out the water slide here. So I cannot tell you if it's workable or not. Since I do see some plants coming in. Well, that looks really cool.
Hey, buddy. Yeah, that makes it look really pretty. Anything else over here? side to side on this one. Definitely got a little squirrely on me there. There we go. Alright, so let's go down and take a look at this place. Or actually, we're going to have to go up to look at it. This lot is playable, but there is a couple of things you will have to do to make it 100% playable. And I will show you that when we get over there. That is really pretty. Let me come back a little bit so we can see. If I can get out of the tree. I do see the candle flo flowing up, but that is okay. It's a cute little room. Nice fairy art. So, this is what the first building looks like. Jump out the window. Double check to make sure there ain't a second floor. A lot of these do. Okay, so, we'll come up the hill. We can either go this way. I should have let the... Uh, Christmas tree up. And yes, yeah, so you can go in here. Which is nice because it brings you to the secret world. Okay, and believe it or not, this thing's uh, kind of trapped in the tree a little bit, but I had no problem getting up in here. Now, here, take a look at this. I thought this was really pretty. Okay, so here's the bedroom. Oh, it might be up too high. Oh, that is a cute little fairy. I don't think there's going to be a happy medium on this one. I knew my camera wasn't going to be the best, but I'm 
still going to try. So you cannot light that fireplace because the bed's in the way. So if you don't mind that, this spot will be fine. Ooh, all types of fairy photos. And another bathroom. And if you notice, there has been no um, 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 kitchens. So over here, this is kind of cool. Didn't know if it was going to work or not, but it did. So on the other side of that, come up these stairs and we come to a little hot tub area. Ooh, I don't know if I can get a good view. Hey, Melody. Later. I just thought that looked really nice in there. Got water coming down everywhere. With the bubbles. That'd be so cool. In real life, anyways. Okay, I'll just go back on down. And we'll move along. Go to this area. So, this section right here, you have to go up into this section to access it. So, I'll just go on up. Hey, Lars's butt. So in here, cute little bathroom, and the way to go down is right down there, but I do believe this is a two-story one, it is, and I am surprised that tree was not in the way. So, oh, this is going to be hard. I might have to take down walls and stuff here. Just where I can show it off. So if you see a fireplace going, you know I was able to do it. Well, I'm so sorry for uh, the bad camera view, but this place was too pretty not to show off. Okay, so there is no third floor on that, but we're going to imagine that, that we actually came down these stairs to go into this place. Oh, that looks warm and inviting. Beautiful glow. sides look so nice. Hmm, I think I went into this bathroom, but if you cannot use it, that would be the reason right there that there's just not enough room and the footprint is too big. Yeah, I really like that look. Okay, and out here you get a nice little bird feeder.
out of school. area <clears throat> okay so I think we're gonna get to go off to the left first let's take a downwards look well that looks really cool and if we come on in here we got a beautiful little sauna area the elevator, elevator, ladder. Well, I don't think the fire pits are lit anymore, but you can sit for sure on that pillow, light that fireplace, you can sit on that pillow. That one over there, I'm not sure. Over here, everything's good to go. Take a look around. did not look down there and yes we will go back up eventually the outside bathroom yes but I don't know if it's workable or at least playable that tree might have wiped out that okay so one of the nice things right here so how close uh, those ladders are to each other. This looks really cool. To me, anyways. Ooh. Nice couple of meditation spots. And in here... We got a little bit of skills. I like that picture. That was pretty cool. And I do believe we get all the bugs. Whoops. Oh, there ain't no happy medium on that one. Sorry. Whoops. Alright, there should be a door here somewhere right there so let's go in here <coughs> excuse me so yeah that looks really cool I just wish I could uh, get a better camera view. Well, duh. Sure. Well, sure, it always works that way. Yeah, this room looks really nice. Alright, so that is the top room of that area. And now we're going to go take a look at this area. And this is a spot where I had to do a couple of things. Okay, so this tree right here was right here. Sims couldn't move up, so I moved that all the way. And they still couldn't get up to that little platform. So, what you're going to have to do is raise up this terrain just a little smidge. And that should be enough for your sims to be able to get up here. Now 
Now this area, you can walk in front of this uh, bench, but you can't sit upon it. I think it's because of the footprint of all the stuff underneath it. Alright, and the only other cooking area is right here. So you got that from Solani. Well, this looks so pretty. Okay, but once after I did both of those, I was able to go up to the ladder. So, we'll go up here. In this room, is this basically the other access to the ladder? Those leaves are not interfering with anything, so that's always a nice thing. And so then you can come up here, you can go left or right. And we will go. I guess we're going left. A very cute little bedroom. Sadly, you cannot light that fireplace. Maybe if you exchange spots with this dresser with the fireplace, you might be able to, but. You can access the bed. Ooh, there's two doors. And yes, every little bedroom has its own little bathroom. Now this one, you can use everything. That looks cool. out a little bit just where we can take a peek through and of course and yes we have one more floor so cool okay so uh, both sides have their own little uh, hookah area oh, am I up too high yeah I wish you'd give me the great camera angle yes <laughs> Gee, I wish this thing would calm down. See, so stand up shower. And believe it or not, the toilet, that toilet for sure does work. Ooh, I went the wrong way. Nice little chess area, though. Ooh, I'm not going to get a good angle on that. Here, let me just do this. So, that's what it looks like. Let's go to a closer look at and take a look at this build a little bit better. And as always, if you end up enjoying this lot and or video, you're more than welcome to give it a thumbs up. Yeah, that just looks so cool. Almost Mary Poppins to me. Anyways, you're more than welcome to give this video a thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber and you find yourself enjoying my content, you are 
also more than welcome to subscribe. And of course, don't forget to hit that notification button and or bell. Well, that looks pretty cool. Normally I publish three videos a day, two from the gallery lines and one from Maxis. a little bit better and I do like that tree coming right through the middle not right there but next floor down the look of this one. And if you have anything to say, you're more than welcome put it in the comments. Know anybody who would like to see this pretty lot in video form? You're also more than welcome to share this video. And of course, the most important thing of all, please take a look at this creator's other creations. That's some really beautiful ones. In my humble opinion, anyways. Yeah, that just looks really cool. Yeah, just that looks really cool, alone everything else here. Hi, Blondie. fan of that hot tub area. Alright, we'll take a look at this one. Then eventually we'll take a top-down view. Ooh, too quick. still wants to be all squirrely on me. Can we start off with that one? Yes, we did. So, top-down view it is. Even though this one, these ones have uh, glass ceilings, or glass roofs anyways. Whoop. I think we'll just stay on one uh, building, go down, then come back up.
actually be able to see this a little bit better. Or show it off a little bit better. Anyways, that's really cool. Okay, so right here is an open ceiling. And I did not see the glass roof going over it. It might be. But if not, well, I suppose it doesn't really matter if that one is actually cold. Because there's no bedrooms in there. So, but if you want to fix it, uh, go to one of my uh, The Sims 4 helpful tips in one of the episodes. I uh, show you how to fix ceilings. Actually, two episodes. It won't be the one that you click on walls and get the yellow line over it. It'll be the other one where you have to drag the floor. Still works all right. Yeah, beautiful gazebo area. I don't know which areas I enjoyed the most. We did not look at the top-down view of this. Yeah, beautiful uh, lighting in that one. So you definitely need those, both of that barbecue down there and that fire pit if you actually want to eat here. There is no basement. And wow, where am I going to go to showcase off this place? Something like that. Something from way over here in the side. And just take a look through there. Which looks pretty cool in its own right. Oh, that does look pretty cool. Maybe from this way? No. If you're still watching this, you're more than welcome to leave a comment. Yeah. Right there, I think that will do it. You can pretty much see everything. It looks really cool. So, hopefully I'll catch you on the next episode. And until then, later. <laughs>